Okay, everyone. Um, I have these laid out on the floor. Um, that's, um, it's hard working with that cube stamp that I have. And I can only produce them on a large scale or whatever. So this is this whole thing I've been working on for the past week. Um, coming up with something. And this is really about how fractal central ghost number cubes and how fractal magic ghost number cubes mix go together. There's some sort of correspondent calculus between them. Um, and these numbers I'll try to explain. This is a magic ghost number cube. I'm sure most of y'all seen it before. If y'all haven't, um, I'll have a link in the description to show you how to make your own magic ghost number cube. The main thing to remember is that it doesn't stop at 37 like I thought it would. But that's only the ghost numbers. The one circled in pencil, the central, central ghost number, the four, eight purple inner ghost numbers, and the eight red outer ghost numbers would give you 37 no matter what magic ghost number cube you chose. And again, no matter what ghost number cube you choose, um... It's the most you can divide seven, um, the central ghost number into the resulting total outer ghost number or outer numbers with or all the numbers of a magic ghost number cube is 42. That's every single number, the ghost numbers, the um, the secondary primary numbers, the the primary numbers and the central ghost number. Now this is only the in inner cube. The inner cube, there's also an outer cube, but I don't count that in this. But, um, and that could change with an outer cube, but the inner, inner cube, the most you can divide the central ghost number two into it is 42 times. And again, I'll post a link to the to the traditional way to make your own magic ghost number cubes where you can check this out for yourself. So that's a magic ghost number cube. That's one instance. The primary numbers are in blue. That's what makes the central ghost number and that's what makes everything really. Primary numbers 1, 0, 4, 7, 3, and 2. I just put them there randomly. Um, and this is a fractal central ghost number cube that I made out of that stamp that I told you about. And what I do with these, the way I do these, the way I fractalize them, um, is that I, I take the same numbers that I put up on that magic customer cube, and I circle it around in the same positions on this three by, or nine by nine by nine fractal cube. And then I, for the ones, for instance, I put a tiny one in front of each of the faces that face it. For the zeros, I put a zero. And for the fours on top, I put the fours. And same goes with the sevens in, on the back, the threes in the front, and the twos on bottom. And I leave the same 17 central ghost number. And, uh, when you add all up the primary numbers, the blue primary numbers in each one, that gives you a red ghost number, central ghost number, fractal central ghost number. I add up all those fractal central ghost numbers, and it gives me 153. When I divide 17 into its central ghost number, it comes out 9. But 9, as I've shown in a previous video, that represents the number of faces, the number of cubes on a face. This is a nine by nine by nine fractal cube. So, and here's these other numbers. I divided 153 for this fractal cube into the 629 that I got from the, the ghost numbers only of the magic ghost number cube. 629 and it comes out 4.111 I did the same thing with 9 fractal number going into the 9 fractal magic ghost number Q 37 which is up here and it comes out 4111 
in to infinity or forever. So that's that. That's that example. This example. There's another magic ghost number cube on top, and the fractal of it, version of it on the bottom. There's one, two, three, four, five, six. Same thing down here. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I did the tiny primary numbers and the tiny ghost numbers added up on the interiors. And um, the top magic ghost number cube. When you add just the ghost numbers, I didn't circle them, but it's the central ghost number, the eight purple inner ghost numbers, and the eight red outer ghost numbers, and, and plus the central ghost number. I added all those up, and it's 777, and the central ghost number goes into it, again, 37 times, but that's just the ghost numbers. The total would amount and go to any magic ghost number cube is 42. I'll show that right there again. Um, 840 is just another uh, level of the numbers you add, but 882, 20, 21 goes into 882, 42 times. And down here, this is 189. For those all the little tiny red one red numbers added up 21 goes into 189 nine times which signifies the nine cubes on each face and again I went to this and I did 189 goes into 777 4.111 times and also nine going into 37 4.111 times. That's what you get when you have a 9 by 9 by 9 fractal cube. Um, this is another example. 4 for the primary numbers 400215, and it's just random again. And um, these are just the ghost numbers the 8 red outer ones, the purple red purple, eight purple inner ones, and the central ghost number 12, added those up, that's 444, the central ghost number 12 goes into 444, 37 times, but its real value, its real complete value is 42, 12 goes into 542 times, and here's a fractal, ghost number Q, fractal, central ghost number Q, comes to 108, and uh, central ghost number 12 goes into 108 nine times. This is the faces again, and nine goes into 37, um, 4.111 times, and 108 goes into 44, 4.111 times. And um, so then um, I decided I'm not gonna do every single one but um, I did a, I did four of every single one, a four face, a, f a four by four by four, a four by four by four fractal cube. And uh, this is for the one, two, three, four, five, six, which is right up here, the first one I did. And uh, 84 all together for the ghost numbers, for the fractal ghost number. And um, I multiplied that, or I divided that into, uh, hold on to it. That's not the correct one. I showed you the wrong one. It's this one, one, two, three, four, five, six. And it's seven, seven, seven. I divided 84 into seven, seven, seven. And it comes out 9.25. And um, this four, zero, zero, Two one five is this one right here, and it spits out um, forty eight, and uh, forty eight goes into forty four, four hundred forty four, nine point two five times again, and uh, um. 
um, this is the this is a 104732 this is a 104732 menstrual number this is in fractal form and it comes out to 68 and I used its central ghost number or its fractal ghost number 629 divided it into there and it comes out again 9.25 times so a four uh, four by four by four would be, give you a nine point two five, and uh, um, so then uh, then I did a uh, four by four by four by four a four by four by four sorry um of a one zero four seven three two fractal coach number one of these samples I have over here and uh, I got 272 out of these and the central ghost number 17 goes into it 16 times and that's for the 16 cubes on the face and uh, 272 goes into 269 629 the magic ghost number fractal goes into it 2.3125 5 times and then I did the 16 fractal ghost number to the 37 of the magic fractal ghost number and that comes out the same thing too 2.3125 times this is going to be the longest video I've made um this is another example this is a 1 2 3 4 Five, six example of a magic ghost number cube but this is in fractal form and um, it has a 21 as in the magic ghost number cube and that 21 goes into the resulting 336 16 times which stands for the 16 cubes to a face and um, then uh, that's the magic ghost numbers fractal number 777 and I divided 336 from this fractal central ghost number into 777 2.312 five times like this 16 by 16 by 16 2.1 2.3125 and um lastly I did this one and this is a five by five by five fractal central ghost number cube and this is the example over here the example right there four zero zero two one five did that over here well that's a that's a three by three by three this is a four by four by four and the resulting central ghost or the central ghost number the resulting fractal ghost number is 300. 12 goes in 325 times, which stands for the 25 cubes to a face. And the 25 goes into 37, which is, goes into it 1.48 times. And the 300 goes into the magic ghost number cubes, 444 fractal ghost number, 148, 1.48 times. And, um, all in all, this starts to create some sort of a, a calculus. This is the 37s that they're ranked in. Four by four by four cube, fractal cube, nine by nine by nine fractal cube, 16 by 16 by 16 fractal cube, 25 by 25 by 25, and 36 by 36 by 36. Um, I showed that, uh, Four goes into 37, 9.25 times. Nine goes into 37, 4.111 into infinity times because it's added by nine, or it's divided by nine. 16 goes into 37, 2.3125 times. 25 goes into 37, 1.48 times. And 36 goes in 37, 1.02777 off to infinity. 
plus 36 reduces to 9 numerologically. Um, and this is a more accurate count because 42 is the number that a magic potion cube will go to if you use all the numbers in one and then divide them, the central question number into it. So 4 goes into 42. 4 is a cube, 4 by 4 by 4 goes into 42 10.5 times. 9, 9 by 9 fractal, 9 by 9 by 9 fractal cube goes into 42. 4.6666 off into infinity. That's 9. 16 goes into 42. 16 fractal cube. 16, 16 by 16 goes into 42. 2.65, 6 2.625 times, um, 25 by 25 by 25 fractal cube goes into 42, 1.68 times, 36 goes into a 42, 1.1666 is off into infinity because 3 plus 6 is 9. Um, so I tried to have some fun right here down to what in calculus would be the limit, I guess. 42 goes into 42 one time, but if you switched the 49 that would come after 36 with 42, it would just be a repeat of the 42 divided by 36 above. It would be a 1.1666 and off into infinity. Um, so then I decided to reverse it back to its normal place and do 49 going into 42 is 0 0.857142 and then 64 the next resulting cubic fractal cube would go into 42 0 0.65625 um, so this is sort of like a calculus derivative more accurately focused on 42 than 37 because the magic ghost number cube if you took in all the numbers every single one and divide, divided it by the central ghost number it would be 42 for any magic ghost number cube and again I'll put a link in this long drawn out video so you can test this out for yourself to see that 42 is the number 42 is the number for the magic ghost number cube any kind well, oh, thanks a lot for watching.